Hello, and thank you for messing around. Vampire Survivors Beswick continues with episode 103 right now. All right, Minna on Mount Moonspell. Duplicators on the map. Bracer is useless. Hollow Heart is not great, but it's all I have. Da -da -da -da. Let's get Sarabande from the start. Empty Tome, good. Cannabra Doors on the map, Spinach is on the map. Clover for crits with Slash. Empty Tome. Cronus Box for damage. Pomolo's on the map. Clover for luck. Try and get crown early. Armor for defense. Armor. There's the crown. Now I go straight to spinach. Not this is popping off a lot faster than that other run, which inexplicably died to Tengu. Don't know what happened there, just all of a sudden, they were wiping me out. Okay. Spinage. Don't want to deal with the Atlantean. So why am I going to it? I'm not even going to get the ring, I'm just going to discard it. Oh, golden eggs, I guess. Ooh, that wasn't good. Empty tome, make sure bloody tear never stops. I'll heal up, up all of it. I want to get the damage, that way when the elemental wave shows up, I can wipe them out ASAP. I grab the clover first, that's why I grab Pomola first on the other run. It's usually what I do since it's the free thing. You can just afford to go grab it first, then well it's closest to the Pomola, so I'm gonna grab that. That is not two vacuums. That is an attract orb in a vacuum. More importantly, it's not two attract orbs, it's an attract orb in a vacuum. Is it vacuum? I keep calling it vacuum, but I swear. I heard someone else say magnet. Which might, you know, it does magnet things. But that's the stat, which would be weird. There's some chests for me. Lucky Clover. Lucky Clover, again. Crown, got a level. Ooh, Tormus Box is nothing, eh? That's dangerous. Armor up. I had armor too. Armor, Hollow Heart, 700 health. Metaglio, and Pomerola maxed. Yet still, they tore through me. Alright, I don't need to stick around here anymore. I can start beating the from a tag Leo left. Ah, I need to get Chroma's box up because these can be one shot. Narrowly, but they can. Not crown first, obviously. Heck, how are they surviving so bad? I mean, I was two-shotting them, and the might was lower than it should be right now. Huh, that's weird. No, obviously, empty tome. Never stop the whip! Uh-oh, that could have been bad. Remember, no... No chests. 
I'm likely, but I can lose off of it. I get curse. Now, now we're gonna be Metaglio left. It's almost as good as Metaglio nothing. God, what even was that? That was complete nonsense. Everything I talk about is complete nonsense, but that especially was nonsense. I miss that axe murderer. Turns out they were an axe manslaughter. Completely different. Got a couple years off the sentence for that one. Yeah, just one day swing the axe and chop chop. Jury totally believed that it was an accident. You can look it up yourself. It's on the imaginary net. Along with all my viewers. Ha ha! But thanks for watching, everyone who is watching. I hope the new time slot is working out. It does seem to be beeping up the views a tiny bit. I mean, sure, I could do research on all these. Oh, get 100 views a day, 100 subscribers a day, all that stuff. But that would be intelligent. And I'm beating every stage with every character in Vampire Survivors. So clearly that has nothing to do with what I do. Da, 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 da. Okay. Oddly, I think I'm making better time because these didn't spawn until I was way later. The weird hack things? No, I guess I shouldn't call them hacks because that's another enemy. Uh, the hunched over things. Hmm. Oni Babas, maybe? chest and I don't need to fear it. Probably should have stuck inside the thing. Let them come to me. Let me get the cracked orb just so I can get all the gems faster. Oops, ran into you. Okay, now they're going down faster for some reason. That's odd. I haven't limit break might enough to stop that. Weird. Oh, hey, can Labrador. Well, it's not a loss of efficiency if I grab it now. It's on the map already. Oh, and it spawned a candy box too. Yay, luck. Oh, stupid Atlantean. Okay. Because I inexplicably lost, I get awake. Really wasn't intending it to lean on awake so bad in all this, but it just sort of keeps happening because I don't want to waste two hours failing constantly on one character when I could just grab awake and win. Oh, hey, Drowner. Wait, water on ice? What madness is this? You go away now. I probably should have grabbed the Candle Labrador first since it gets more bonus. Candle Labrador, yep. Ok, 
Okay, we're doing well. I uh, can't get in hit Drowner, though. And even with all this might, 200% might, an inverse just cancels it out completely. Well, at least the pulses from Sarah Bond, they are keeping me in the fight pretty well. Plus, 4.6 health regen per second. A lot of things aren't going to break through that. And it's only going to get higher. want to max out before I go for the Oni. They're too dangerous. Man, I still haven't taken them out yet. Well, one down. Four to go. Should I go in? Well, there's still Atlanteans about it all. Seems very dangerous. Not one down. The city should be falling before too long now. Ah, they got him. They got pushed in. Oh, another chest. I should go grab that. Oh, two chests. I can max out. On accident, I can max out. Uh, yeah, maxed out. That's all limit breaking then. Yep. There's city down. Moon's gonna take too long, so I'm gonna push in. Oh man, why are the tangus doing anything? This is not a threatening. Tangus aren't that threatening. Oh. Okay, I got 734 health this time and 5.6 health regeneration. Along with the pulses from Cerebani to make them more durable. Well, keep them back. Then the healing from there. Dictator. Dictator maxed. Means more hits, more damage. And now I just grab the egg and bail. I don't need to go to grab the mask. Don't need to bother with the sword at all. Where's the exit? Oh, got the first. Oh, got the second egg. There it is. Man, that was weird. Alrighty. This should be clear enough to victory. NFT does so much damage. Whoa. Ah, nothing's stopping me now. Yeah. Always at the 19 minute mark, so I'm basically unstoppable. I don't want to leave those, but okay. Boy, those Tango are actually getting in and doing damage. I have a wake, so it's ultimately pointless. There's no way they're chewing through four revives.
Okay, was not expecting that to happen. Oh, the Starburst probably did most of it, but I did get up to do something. Thought I would be fine. Enough, at least, till I got back. But hey, random event's gonna random event. At least if I go up, I'm fine. So I guess when I get free of the mountain pass, I'm gonna go snaking around diagonally. Yeah, I could have stuck with flowers like I, well, mentioned on the failed run. Oh, the Arcana chest. I should go grab that. It would even be Slash. Probably Slash. Yeah, I do have the Clover. All the way at the back, eh? Well, enough crits will massively take them out. Uh-oh. Oh, Rochi's here. Oh, did I grab a rosary without noticing it? Without the effect on, it's actually really hard to see. That or maybe this, the bloody howling is so... Bloody tear is so big. Is that a second candy box? That's three candy boxes on the map. That's crazy. Yeah, I could have grabbed one to get Vento Sacro to turn into Walu Walu, but I didn't want to. I'll save that for Rose. Her Royal Highness. Huh? No, I was... Orologrian. I'll pronounce it right one day, you'll s Well, you won't see, you'll hear. Unless you see my words, which... Oh, that would be the captioning. In which case... I'm waving. Why am I saying I'm waving? Well, whatever. That's my catchphrase. Well, whatever. That's what you can count on. Random commentary, complete nonsense, and a whole lot of Empire Survivors bezwicking. Oh, one head down. Two, three, four, five. Er, no. Bye, Orochi. Go enjoy your retirement. Oh, big only wave, but... Yeah, they're not getting in the sizes too well. They are super durable, though. That defanged one up there I've been watching, and it just isn't going down. Hey, big old ghost, too. Oh, small ghost wave. Yeah, they are barely going down. Oh, there's death. Hi, death. Bye, death. Thanks for ending the run. 101 million. Um, Right, up there with the knives. So that was an edge. And it's competing with Cervande too. Alright, but that's the first of Minra's down. Mina's even. So, stick around. Alright, back to the Vampire Survivors. Mina Manara is going to Lake Foscari. Get that soundest of the old sanctuaries going. And, uh, yep, that's correct. Should have tested all this up beforehand. Alright, do I want Serbande first, or... I mean, this is the funniest option. Crown is on the map. 
spinach is not. So I want Toronis box. Hollow Heart, Corona, Spinach, Empty Tome. Then something else. Track Dwarf is not on the map. That'll be good to get levels. Sweet Empty Tome already. Ah, uh, Duplicator is also an option. Ah, uh, and Can Operador. Oh well. In fact, I'll want Candelabrador over something else. Uh, yeah, I'm fine with cutting out the defensives. For here, at least. Since I do have armor on the ground. And the revives coming in. Don't really need spinach this early, but why not grab it? Oh, nice chickeny. Ah, uh, nice easy wave here. One clover get. Two clover get. Three clover get. I'll um, get it out of the pool. Get all that XP as fast as possible. Oh, one of them was Kindle Armor. What was the other one I wanted? Duplicator. Nice having an evolved weapon to start with. That way I don't have to worry about limit breaks. Hmm. What's one candle Labrador? Hasn't shown up again. It's not all that common. Oh, bossy. Really? Same time as the duplicator, eh? There's one more to go. There we go. Now I can grab this stuff. Get going on the Terran through Bloody Way Express. Nope, this was the wrong way. But it'll be the right way eventually. Crown first is better. Wait. Then I can go grab the Metaglio and then the Arcana. Oh, mushroom dude. Still not used to being it upside down. It puts us here. Very hard to see that one. Just one more crown to pick up. I got plenty of backup to grab too. Nice. Now I can banish Torona's box. Wait. What? Oh, there's not enough stuff on the wall to wall break. Is that just like that normally? The small passages make it really hard to see. Yeah, I have no trouble with it in normal mode. Nope. No speed here. Big enough to cover my bottom. Nope. 
Yeah, it's getting the full might hit, so... It's not gonna... Metaglio first, then our economy. How do I expect to keep mezzing around on the Vampire Survivor's Beswick? Yeah, it's kind of what... Oh no, not you. At least I should be able to heal up pretty consistently. Good, got that chicken. Now I can go grab the Metaglio. Man, I mentioned it a few times, so this is more than I've ever seen the Stalker when I was doing all the other runs. Like, not just do the normal thing, but all my runs off camera prior to unlock everything. Now there's a chest I really should not be trying to get. Decent amount of skulls for right now. Oh, that was so annoying. No real ne need to get the bracer. I don't think it affects shooting it out like it does. But hey, I have it anyway. Da, 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 da. Oh, oh. Yep, there's the other Kana. Wait. Is it like looping? I think there's like a weird loop effect going on. Not oh, one our Atlantean down. Sarabande would have been safer, but I wanted the comedy of Boogaloo in the beginning. Make the entire screen one big tear. Perhaps even a bloody one. Good old Mina Minra on the Vampire Survivor's Peswick. Silly algorithm. Man, just baffling how it works sometimes. The Avatar and Furnace video gets no views for like the first couple hours, then, you know, ten, a couple later, and just like weird. And that's a success for me. Thanks for watching. I appreciate everyone who watches this far. Wish I could do more to repay you, but hey. Hopefully, cutting down the opening to just a few seconds, because you gotta hit that. Dumb algorithm thing. Oops. There's only so much you can do with Vampire Survivors without going into super gimmicks, but 
not really getting a whole lot of comments about that, so if you do have anything you want, go ahead and leave a comment and I'll get to it. Or leave it on a Dex video. I have a lot more people see it. Yeah! God, I really need to watch and comment on his videos. I'm so far behind on everything because of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. But that's over with for now. I'm mean, sure I'm going to play some Unicorn Overlord, but I have so much stuff to catch up on. I'm finally going to have the time to. I mean, sure, I'm going to stream a bit of Unicorn Overlord. But not like every moment that isn't Vampire Survivors or eating or working isn't going to be dedicated to it. Because I have to fix all the Beswick videos. This one arm, right? Nothing up there but the skull and the lock. Now, well, even the mantises are getting taken out pretty easy. Still do have curse and charm on. Hey, why are the fishes? Discard. Probably gonna get hit by an Atlantean at some point just because I got so much bloody tear on the screen. You know, I don't know why I always leave the forest to go back into the forest instead of just taking the corridor down. Huh, strange. This big I thought it would be more on the bottom of me. Oh, gotta get that chest. Does nothing but gotta make sure it isn't on the ground. Oh, there's my egg. And like usual, I will somehow get to 19 minutes and then have to make up 11 minutes worth of jibber-jabber. Sure, I could cut it out. That would be smart. But, well... If I was smart, I would have more viewers. Thanks for watching. <laughs> yeah, it's like all those, hey, grow your channel, gotta do research, and it's just like... Well... Okay, so I do gimmick runs of the game. Well, I am doing gimmick runs of the game. It's not helping me grow. No. I'm not going to make some sort of big, dumb facial thing on the thumbnail. That looks really stupid. How is that a thing? Besides, if I did that, my videos would get no views. This is not a mug you want to see. Nor is a mug that I want to share, even if it was one. Okay, now I'm in victory mode. Oh, only 243 area. Man, they are not coming all that fast, eh? Well, I do have lower clearance, even if it's not as screen-consuming as I was hoping, but... You can watch Minra... What? What hit me? What was that? Thing I got awake. Oh, I should probably just sit in Sammy Farm. Yep, there's Minra's randomness going along with Boogle Illusions. Hilarious. Why do I keep saying Minra? It's Minna. I'm actually saying it longer and harder. Oh, Green Knight. Use that axe to chop down the Melises. Come on. Do it. 
Well, it's either that or you just get whipped to death. Yeah, I gave you the option. You did not want to take it. No. Nah. Save it for her royal highness. Rose Dan Furnace. Such a daddy's girl. No, oh, should keep it down low. The way it hits things. Don't know what happened there. Maybe the boss one got in, but still. It's 300 ish health, regeneration, and armor. It shouldn't be doing this much. It shouldn't be doing anything. Yeah. They're doing damage. This is odd. I mean, if I keep going up, it'll be fine, but I eventually do run out since it's this level and not other ones where I have infinite. Oh. Well, with this, I go down as far as I can. That way, I can have time to go back up. At least all that might is focusing hard with the NFT. Oh. Wow, that's terrible ghosting. No way I can avoid hurting that. Still don't know quite sure how it works. Does it heal from being hit? Does it heal just from being on screen? Oh wow, it can get rosaried? Didn't know that. Most bosses can't, I think. Or at least they're immune to it. Which is the same thing. What am I talking about? Jeez. Well, I only got like two hours of sleep because I was up so late playing <laughs> finishing rebirth. Boy was my stomach not happy when that happened. What a wacky ending that was. Glad I stopped giving a hoot about the mini games and the up proto relic stuff. So that would have held it out for another day. Here I am talking about a completely different game when I have vampire survivors on screen. Look at all them hags getting ripped apart. It's just joyous to watch. Now I need to go to that rosary so that way when the green night wave spawns. Yep, here they are. Yep, there it is. Boy, this is going to be a tight one again. There's a chicken there. Another one somewhere up here. Alright, grab this one. Dang it. I might not actually have enough revives. Huh. A whole bunch of chickens here, so hopefully. Oh, Candle Arbor Door on the map, which I already have. Thank you, random events. Oh, Atlantean spawn. And somehow this is an easier wave. Maybe they do more damage. My might really can't get much higher than this. It's really only the awake hits after this. And maybe putting on Sarah Bonde instead of grabbing something else. But otherwise, I'm as max power as you can get. And it's still so hard to win. But oh, that's Minamina. Minamina. Done. Quarter of a billion with a bloody tear. Oh, thanks for watching.